So finally Resurrection Remix version 6.0 ROM that is built on Android 8.1 have been officially released for OnePlus 5 aka Cheeseburger. And after using this ROM for some time, here's what I have to say. And before we get any deeper, here's a quick installation guide. First, as always, take a full Android backup. Second, it's recommended to doing a full wipe and factory reset. Third, make sure you are running on stock open beta firmware. Fourth, then transfer the ROM, zip file and open Google package to the smartphone and install it. If the installation failed for some reason and you see a error 7 red code line, don't worry, you just have to delete a line of code from the script. This step sounds awful lot of complicated but it's super easy, I'll link a video in the description so that you guys can follow. And after the installation is done, let's come back to the ROM review. The ROM interface looks pretty close to stock while keeping its core trademark design language. From those sleek dot drop boot animation logo to the simple minimal wallpaper. Even subtle icon changes here and there which all adds up and heightens the user experience. If you ask me, describe the ROM in one word, I would say refreshing. And I mean it's refreshing in every possible way. It doesn't come with any bloatware. Hell, it doesn't even have its own browser application pre-installed. So you get my point, right? Coming to the performance side of the things, what can I say? It's stupid fast. The ROM just flies with everyday tasks, jumping between apps is a breeze. Whatever I do, I just can't make it slow. Crazy fast animation, I found no app crashes, no lag, no stuttering, no nothing. And after saying that, I think it can get even faster. Come on Resurrection team, I think you can do it. I can't help it but it just blows my mind how great the initial build is and I'm super hyped up to see how stable it will become after some update rollout. I don't have to talk about the features though, I think most of the people watching this video are fully aware of the customizability feature this ROM offers. But on a quick note, here it is. Simple fluid launcher with some to the point adjustment tools and support for third party icon packs. Precise control over windows animation scale, every possible status bar tweak, lock screen tweak, interface tweak, hardware button e-mapping, selective area specific screenshot option, switching between on screen navigation on a fly, getting precise control over system animations, gestures and the ever popular pie control. Believe me, all these and obviously the 8.1 basic features on top. And I'm not kidding when I say these features that I talked about is the only gist of it. There are like 100 of features in each tab so I'll talk about that in my possible full review of the ROM. And as you can see it's the king when it comes to customizability. You will feel like a compact version of gravity box module is packed right into the OS itself. I don't know this ROM is just near perfect. Yes it needs a little bit of work here and there. But I don't even have to think twice before saying that this is the best initial build release I have ever came across. Hands down. Yes, the battery life is not great. I got somewhere around 4-5 to five hours of screen on time with heavy usage. The standby is not great either which is a bit disappointing for me but then again for a ROM this heavy and feature packed I kinda knew I would get this result but still expecting to see some battery improvements in the near future. As always the camera app is not great and I would recommend even though opening it just high load a modded google camera app you will get amazing results at least better results than the default camera come on. And now we come to the same old question should you consider flashing it? Hell yes man this is one of the best rom available for the oneplus 5 right now and I can guarantee you will not regret it. And yeah that's probably it for today's video. If you liked it then hit the like button, subscribe to the channel, share this video among your friends and let me know what you think about the Resurrection ROM in the comment section down below. I'm Shreemaya, we'll talk to you in the next one till then, eat, breathe and grow old.